Hey, it's Joker here with Fuse Magazine and Rock Rage Radio. I'm with Devour the Day. You got Blake and you got Joey. Hello. Uh, now, you guys are from Memphis, correct? Not originally, but the, the band. band was from Memphis. The band is originally from Memphis. Yeah. Did you hear about the Five Finger Death Punch breakdown oh, in yeah. Memphis? Immediately. Oh, yeah. Like Immediately. Like everybody. Yes. Facebook. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I heard scrolling. about it the next day and I had to go look and see if there was any videos because I was like, what the fuck? Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. scrolling through and it's just changing. The story's changing. Oh, blow up on stage. They got in a band for sound issues on stage. Oh, and then, uh, I don't know, like Ivan had diarrhea. <laughs> had to leave the stage. Well, we saw oh, Ivan not, not a few, we played with him like four or five days after that. Um, and said, I see, they're like right when I asked, I was like, so how are things going? He goes, we've had some interesting nights. <laughs> I was like, yeah, that's a good way of putting it, bud. <laughs> so they're all good. Oh, they're good. Yeah, 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 they're good. They were jamming that night. Um, I believe it was actually a sound issue. Yeah. Like the, the sound just yeah, so that's the real truth, America. The <laughs> sound truth. issue. It was a sound issue. They fired their monitor guy. Oh, so you gotta have a scapegoat somewhere. Right, yeah. right. You don't wanna fire any of the uh, the roadies or the groupies. Well, yeah, and yeah, just get rid of the they're, monitor guy. They're what makes rock and roll rock and roll. <laughs> Somebody's getting fired. You don't wanna schlep your own equipment on stage, and you obviously don't wanna lose your pussy after right. the show. Right, so yeah. get rid of the monitor guy. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Somebody's got to be. You better. never brought blondes on here. <laughs> and you never paid for drugs. <laughs> Not once. Not once. Uh, so, your song, Good Man, you say, I want to be a good man. What's the most noble thing each of you has done? Uh, I am an incredible father, and I know that. Um, and Blake cannot trump that. <laughs> yeah, what am I going to say? Oh, I uh, saved 15 babies from a burn, burning building. You know, that's that's, that's, that's not thing. true. That isn't true. I wish there I was have three. Done that. It was three babies. Yeah. He uh, looked like Tug Speedman at the beginning of the. They were they were <laughs> Joey's babies. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I saved. And my house was on fire, and he said it. So it's a weird situation, <laughs> yeah. but I was like, oh, <laughs> yeah, I oh, probably get, your get kids these babies out, here. out before I was yeah. on fire. Uh, <laughs> sorry, guys, when you grow up, you see this. Okay. That's all right. <laughs> no, no. To, I to my kids when they're like searching the internet. We're talking about how we burned them. Okay. <laughs> Next. <laughs> Your favorite mythical creature of all time. Ooh. Oh. You, you can't say unicorn just because I'm the unicorn, but and I'm here. You know that giant I... flying dog from Neverending Story. Oh, yeah, that's uh, a good was it Atreyu? No, Atreyu is who Fal- rode him. No, it's Falcor. Falcor. That's his name. Was Comfy, yes. great ride, tucked behind his ears, and he had like one of those. Any bad day, you'd be like, Ooh. Protect us from the nothing. <laughs> the nothing is coming. Yeah. Um, what's what, uh, the mythical the, creature? Yeah, the half uh, the uh, the lion uh, eagle. No, liger. No, the liger. The liger. <laughs> that's not mythical. That's real. That's real. I actually we saw two of them in a cage. It pissed on me. It, yeah, it turned around. <laughs> it saw us. It was like it marked me. I'm a liger, bitch. Bam. Yeah. So what is your favorite mythical creature then? Because you just, that's real. Oh yeah. Sharks. 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 <laughs> Never seen one. I don't believe they're real. Well, there's that's a pretty good logic. So, I've seen pictures and stuff, but <laughs> sharks. Okay. I gotta talk about a little music in this. Uh, you're touring with Three Days Grace this summer in June and July. Yep. Uh, is this your first time touring with them? Nope. Uh, we did uh, a bunch of shows last year uh, with them. Great guys. Canadian, so they, they don't do anything wrong. Yeah, so we can't say anything bad about Canadians. They don't do anything. They, <laughs> Canadians are the nicest people in the world. Yeah. So they'll throw their mic stand down on the ground and then say sorry and pick it back <laughs> yeah, yeah. up, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I don't know what that was about. <laughs> Get the fuck up if you want to. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I don't know who said it on stage, but when I saw you guys at SPAC a couple years ago, somebody pointed right at me and said, stand up, and I just kind of went, okay. Oh, that's me. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, probably. I am the pointer. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I've got adrenaline going. I'm like, get up for your own good. You paid for your ticket, dumbass. <laughs> for your own good. <laughs> Dad and heart. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Enjoy yourself. Oh, God. 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 It's your age. It's the kind of dad I am. I'm not going to baby him. My daughter's 10, and I'm just like, do it yourself. Yeah. <laughs> well, I, I have common phrases. Oh, I'm sorry about your accent. Your legs are broken. Well, they're not. Go get it yourself. <laughs> you know? That sounds horrible now. Okay. Uh, no, no. What's the best thing that you've seen on stage during one of your sets? Mm, I will say unforgettable. Uh, guy hands me a prosthetic leg for the final song, and I jam the rest of the song with his foot. <laughs> and then I get back to him. And he was like in the front row. Like, yeah. Oh! Uh, St. 
same show we were talking about earlier. There was we were the, the wall of death, right? So we're about to play Good Man, and I don't think this grandmother realizes what's going on. She doesn't understand that it's a wall of death. I think she thinks it's a giant dance off, and she's taking the lead. So she walks right out in the middle of it. And she's like, <laughs> Mom dancing with her hand like that, and all these kids are like, Get out! Get out of the way! <laughs> and I'm like, Well, here we go. There's a the YouTube video. If you search Welcome to Rockville 2014 Devour the Day, there's a YouTube video of that. So it, it is true because I was there, I was involved in the wall of death. And I was one of the people yelling at her to get out yes, of the way. The I just said, she Fuck it, you're going to get ran over. Her ass and everything. Yeah, and we're like, everybody's like, literally yelling at her to move. She's confused. And she was just like, okay, whatever. She looks like a beachfront community after a typhoon hits. It's like literally wiped out. Yeah. She just got That was here. one of the calmer wall of deaths. We kind of like just went in between each other. <laughs> Everybody just we were scared of her grandma. Slap fives. It's like that scene in Braveheart where they pretended to hate each other and then they got there and they should hate yeah. They mooned everybody. Uh, my island. Your favorite uh, subject to devour, whether it be giant. English. English? It's my favorite subject. <laughs> Oh, okay. Uh, well, I was going to go with food, and then I saw that you're wearing marijuana leaf sunglasses, oh, yeah. so I didn't know if that's one of the things you were going to say. But. I smoke all day, every day. I love it. It's my medicine, but I think vagina would be my favorite thing to devour. It's dirty. Yeah, it's dirty. I mean, you can tell. It's like, nope, nope. Well, I, I've had to do the swoop move before where I went down. And it smelled like tuna fish, and I went right back up. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I was just gonna kiss oh, your yeah, stomach. I was just, just, just kidding. Take it off my socks. <laughs> All right, Blake. Yeah. Yeah. No, I, I had a real interesting situation where I, I went down, and the front half of the business was taken care of, but the back, the hole wasn't. So it was just like this bloom of dark hair. That'll stop you. Oh wow. Yeah. That's like a wrestler's goatee. <laughs> yeah, it was it like a vagina had a goatee. It, 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 had a hidden butthole in the pot. Oh, wow. <laughs> I don't know why I'm She's putting it in my mouth. That really happened? Yeah. That's gross. Yeah, she hadn't come over yet. Right <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> First question we get out of here, which girl was it? Yeah. <laughs> don't give me Where her number. She? Where is she? I'm totally into she? asshole hair. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so uh, what about you, Luke? Um, what's my favorite thing to devour? Yeah. Thing? Subject? Thing. Um, anything. I, I really like, uh, I can't say that one. What? Um, transvestite. I like, <laughs> oh, the semen of transvestites. Yeah. yeah. That, that was said before, so you can't use that again. Really? Yeah. Who said that? Cody. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> transvestite semen. I didn't talk to the guy after that. No. <laughs> Lord of the Rings. I really like interviews. Interviews. I like to interview. And most, do most of yours end in handshakes instead of fist fights? Absolutely. Uh, Absolutely. Only one. Nice. Only nice. one. And, uh, and it's this one. <laughs> <laughs> well, I probably deserve it after the uh, the questions that I've asked you. Uh, this is probably the questions you've never heard before. Yes. Yeah. This so. is the first. That, that, that's the first. I like to devour. now because the show is so popular but I followed Walking Dead from the first time it ever aired first episode for anybody new I, I knew it was a great comic book and I love that show I think that the writing is incredible yeah. uh, so that's probably my favorite yeah I mean we watch that religiously 
Yeah, and it actually, it made me go back and, and watch all the Jose Romero, uh, Dawn, Land, of, the Dawn Dead, of the Dead, Land of the Dead, and all yeah. that stuff. And most of them are, are, are pretty good, but the, that one that, uh, I, don't, I don't know if Rob Zombie had some of it, but it's just Dawn of the Dead. That was my favorite one. But, uh, was there on the Ty Pfeiffer? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 They're in the yeah. shopping mall. That's the, yes. that's, I think that's my favorite zombie. That's probably what I would do, is stand on the roof and pick people off. Yeah, yeah. Just pick up celebrities. Yeah, if you're <laughs> gonna die, you gotta die in style, right? Yeah, people absolutely. pick people that look Have like celebrities fun. and headshot them. <laughs> One last question: You guys gonna be doing any Egypt Central songs today? Mm, not in the cards. No, White Rabbit. I mean, we have done that before. We, we have been doing that. We've been doing that for. Um, but it's not currently set to be set today. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll, maybe we'll, maybe we'll, maybe we'll see. Well, we're working on all this new music, and so we really haven't. That's the best kind of time. I mean, we've had two years of playing this movie, so that's, what, that's really the fuel. But our brain power has been spent on writing a new record. It's going to come out in October. Uh, we just signed a Razor and Tie, so it's been, uh, it's been a really good summer for us. And we're very excited about it. So I love the old. It's, it's heavier. I love the old, the, the first one. You guys came out with it. Oh, thank you, thank you again. So I'm definitely looking forward to this. Is it October? October, something like that. Late fall. Anything else you got to say to the fans? Uh, DevourTheDay.com. All things about the day. Go check it out, baby. Thank you, guys. Absolutely. Thank you, man. Appreciate it, appreciate it.